You know what? I got a better idea. Here, here, babies, play with this. <laughs> yeah, eat it. What's up, Plane Crash Survivors? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for the Forest. All right, guys, we're going to head back into the caves today. I'm going to go back and get the map. You know what I realized yesterday? Um, first of all, two things I realized from yesterday. Number one, I was waiting for, I was waiting for food to finish on the drying rack, and I forgot. I could just put it right here and cook it if I really need to. So I'm going to put the food right here and cook it because I really need to, all right? And also, one of the other things I noticed from last video is that when I went into the cave and I got myself knocked out and dragged away, you know, I grabbed the map where they dragged me to. Like, ah! Really, Cage? Ah! Really? Okay, anyway. <laughs> anyway, I grabbed the map from where they dragged me to. Like, remember when I was hanging upside down in the cave? I grabbed the map, and I know where that cave is. Actually, it's really close to us. So I think we're going to try and get the map today, and then I'd also like to get the climbing axe if possible. All right, I want to start I want to start getting some of these items. Um, I'm thinking one more. Should I actually take the blueberries out of here? Uh, I don't know. They look they look a little small. Let's take the blueberries out of this one and see if we get any seeds. See, I don't uh, Is that all of them? No, it's not. There's one more. Okay. Now, did I get any? I did get seeds. No. Uh, yeah, I got two blueberry seeds. Okay, there you go. That's one blueberry bush, and I get two seeds for it. So that is just awesome. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and put this way, and we are going to plant more blueberry bushes. That's good. Okay, I like the way the blueberry bushes work. They work, um, they actually work quite well. They, they work well. Now, the, these two bushes, when I, like, leave the area, they'll, like, go away after a bit. At least that's what happened to the other one. Um, so that's, uh, I didn't get any from that one. So I'm wondering if I, hmm. Yeah, there's no more. Okay, so I didn't get two that time. So that, that's a little worrisome. I might not have let them grow, uh, big enough. So, oh, one other thing I want to show you before we head out, uh, to go get the map. Um, the map, and I think we get the compass too. Uh, I wanted to show you right here. This is the box where the flares are. So let's stock up on some, oh, is that the only one, huh? All right. So we got to be a little bit careful with the flares. We can't just go shooting flares willy-nilly. Um, I'll definitely save them for the big bosses, like, um, Armsy, uh, Virginia, Cowman, and whatnot. But, um, it is nice to have them some. I, may, I, I hope there's somewhere else I can get some. I'm pretty sure there isn't the caves. It's just when it comes to the caves, I really don't know. And, um, the map is going to really help us in the caves. Actually, I don't even know if I showed you the map, honestly. Last video was so cut up because I kept dying and, like, it was just, like, you know... It got to be too much of the same over and over and over, so I'm not sure exactly what you saw, to be perfectly honest, but I did get the map, but then I lost it because I died again, and when I died the second time, I was dead for good, so I had to reload the game, and I reloaded it from before the cannibals took me away, so... All right, let's grab some stuff from here, and uh, we're gonna do after this after this video. We are gonna do some more building. I'm not gonna do more than two two videos of uh, exploration at any time. Um, we got plenty of drinks. Yeah, we got plenty of drinks, plenty of water. We're gonna be just fine. Yeah, I'll never do too many uh, too many videos of one thing. I did a lot of building videos. That's why I wanted to go out and do some um, some exploration for you guys. I mean, variety is the spice of life. Look at that athleticism, thirty athleticism, baby, twenty four strength. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get going. Let's keep ourselves fed and get that strength. Up. Oh my God, there's a lot of cannibals here. Wow. Wow. Who thought there'd be so many cannibals in a cannibal camp? That's um, it's a little disconcerting. Uh, I think that that uh, that hut I'm looking at right now—that's the one we have to get to. So let's see if we can get to it. Nothing going on here, cannibals. Nothing to see here. Just going down this rope right here. Yeah, so when I, um, when I, like, release myself from captivity after the cannibals, because whenever the cannibals knock you out the first time, they, um, they take you into this cave, and you can get away, you know? Um, but, you know, I got the map, but I, I, uh, reloaded, so I don't have the map anymore, so that's what we're doing back here. All right, so let's see what we got here. Okay, so this guy didn't do as well as I did, so, sucks to be him, right? All right, not sure exactly where stuff is in here, so we'll have to have a little look around. Alright. So one thing I did want to point out to you guys is that I forgot to mention this, but I did this for cave exploration purposes. Um, color grading, I turned it up to M131. Uh, so you could see a little bit better in here. So, I mean, there's the compass. I like the, um, and there's the map. Awesome. Wow, the map was that close to me the whole time. I mean, in, in, in some ways, I do like the fact that, um... 
uh, the darkness is a problem, and that's really cool. Uh, but at the same time, like, if you guys can't see the video, then what are we doing, you know? So, all right, let's look around here a little bit more, just to kind of look around. Yeah, this is where I was hanging, I think, in this area. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. All right, guys, now that we've got the map, let's take a look at it. Um, I had it out earlier. Where is it? Uh, it's right here. Okay, so when you're in the caves, you'll eventually start uh, building the cave map. And when you're outside, you'll eventually start building an overworld map. It's actually really, really cool. I do like it. I do done like it a lot. All right, so let's get the heck out of here, though. This is not a place I want to be. Although, to be perfectly honest, up here isn't a place I want to be either. Isn't there like 50 cannibals up here? <laughs> oh, man. The next thing we're going to look for today is the rock climbing axe. So let's see if we can find that. Oh, what's going on over here? Alright, so take this out. Let's get some stamina back so if we have to run, we can. Because I'm sure those guys didn't go too far. Okay. Right, I'm going to leave that alone for now. Let's come over here and get the dynamite and get, get ourselves some sodas and stuff. That, actually, I don't really... There we go. Now we need some sodas. Oh, I don't need any dynamite. Okay. I right, probably don't need, need any soda either. Okay, great. All right, I'm going to go back and save, and then we are going to head out to the spot where I believe the the climbing axe is. All right, guys, I think I have an idea where it is, maybe. Yes, no, maybe so. I have no clue. Uh, oh, no, that's not true. I do have a clue. Um, I think it's to the northeast of the, of the sinkhole. I was looking at some maps online. It looks like it's northeast of the sinkhole, possibly. I'm not really sure. Um, running around the island now will be really cool with the map. Actually, I probably should have got the map the fir first thing I did. Because now that I'm running around the island, um, I'll like, you know, well, map out the island. It'll be freaking awesome. I guess the idea is as you're running, al as you're running along, you're drawing out the map. Which is great. I think more, uh, I think more games should do maps like that. Right? You get, you get a piece of paper, maybe even have to get a pencil or something. And then you can start drawing out your own maps. Instead of just putting a map in the game, you know, um, make the player do something for it. And, uh, you know, that way they get a map and, you know, you don't leave the map out of the game. Because some, some developers like to make the game harder by leaving a map out. And I don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. It doesn't, it doesn't feel harder to me. It just feels more frustrating. And uh, that's never something you want to feel uh, when someone's playing your game. Okay, so... I think the cockpit is over here, so that means the sink sinkhole must be over there. I think the um, I think the cave system we have to climb down to is probably over there somewhere. Um, let's take a look at our map really quick. Okay, all right. So it's not showing too much yet. So that's you know, that's fine. We should really go out of our way to explore the island too, because the more of the island we explore, the more that's going to be opened up. Uh, you know, by use of the map. So. All right. Oh, I'd like to get that guy. Ah, uh, I still have not gone out hunting, guys. I really, really have to, man. I've just been so busy um, lately. All right, so that should be the cockpit right over there. Is it not rendered in yet, or I don't know? It's kind of weird. Pretty sure that's where the cockpit is, though. So let's go on over there and see what we can see. Chase this rabbit down a hill. Are we actually gonna get him? No, I didn't think so. I don't know why he swung down. I, try, I want him to swing side to side, but if you look down, he usually swings down. There we go. Got ourselves a rabbit. Very nice. That's going to come in handy. All right, that rabbit skin's always, always useful. All right, guys, I think I'm getting close. And um, I just found this freaking smorgasbord of, of uh, flares, man. Holy crap. I'm, I should actually mark this. I'll remember where it is. Oh, there's arrows, too. Oh, man. Yeah, I'll remember where it is. It's right by the cockpit, but I am going to mark this at some point. Let me go ahead and uh, load all these up. Well, this is this is a great find, people. Will it ever let you stop loading? 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. I'm thinking this might be bugged. It'll put a lot of flares in there, man. Here, let's see if we can put over 20. Oops, I mean, do that. There we go. Is that 21? Okay. Yeah, the flare gun's got to be bugged. I mean, it's let me put 21 flares in the damn thing. All right. So anyway, that is a great find right there. That stuff will respawn too next time I restart the game. So that is just wonderful. All right. So we're looking for some tents apparently um, over here. So let's come on and take a look. At, let's take a look at the map. All right. And yeah, this looks about the this looks around this right area. I think we got to keep going this way. And I'm just going to be looking for these tents.
All right, guys, I walked about two feet forward, and I found some tents, and I think we just found the place where the rock cli where the rock climber is going to be. I believe this is it. It's, um, yep, yep, yep. Okay. Let's get down there. All right. So I don't think I don't think we're supposed to go down this way. Um, I think that we like basically this is the way you get out after you've gotten the rock climber. Um, but there's a way you can kind of like kind of skirt down the side of the wall, you know, to kind of like not die. <laughs> um, let's see if we can find it. Yeah, it's over here, I believe. Um, let me go ahead and get up a torch. Okay, there we go. All right, like this sucker up. All right, so yeah, yeah, right here. See right there? You're supposed to climb out after you get the rock climber. But if you come over here on the side, um, I probably should have saved the game first. <sighs> Let me go save the game first because I've never done this before. So you know what I was just thinking, guys? Um, some of these tents you can, like, actually use as, uh, as save, like, spawn point thingies. Um, but not these. I just wanted you to, I just wanted you to know that. Um, the ones you can, like... Oh, did I kill... Oh, God, I killed it with the tree. Dude, I killed this turtle with the tree. I didn't even notice. I saw it fall towards the turtle, and I was like, yeah, that'd be funny if it fell on the turtle and killed him. I didn't think it actually did, though. <laughs> well, there's some easy meat for me. All right, you enjoy that, birds. I'm going to get down here, and let's uh, let's see what we can see, man. i got to try and do this little shimmy move, this little uh, skirt down the side of the wall thing, uh, and try and get this uh, climbing axe. Because the reason I want... Honestly, the ultimate item I want in the game right now is the... Is the, the um, I forget what it's called. It's like a modern bow, or it's some kind of, like, tier 2 bow, you know? And, um, I really want that item really badly. But you need the climbing axe and the rebreather to be able to get it. So, that's why I'm here trying to get the climbing axe. I mean, the climbing axe is something I would have wanted anyway, but, you know, we gotta get it before the, uh, bow. It's like a, it's like a compound bow or something, or, I don't know, some kind of super bow, I don't know. Alright, so let's see if we can do this. Alright, there we go. And then we come down here. Nope, 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 okay. And there we go. Beautiful. And here's the climbing axe. Oh, no, that's not the, that's a piece of rope. All right, climbing axe somewhere around here. So let's see if we can find it. Uh, what's that, a bar? Cool. Oh, oh. Um, you know what, guys? You know what? My cannibal sense is tingling. Um, or should we use this? Yeah, let's just use this. The hell with it. This thing's freaking badass, man. Freaking flare going like 80 flares in it. <laughs> freaking ridiculous. Hello, cannibals. I can smell you. There you are, you dirty pieces of crap. There you go, you're on fire. Uh oh. You're on fire. Okay, let's fall back. Okay. You gonna be done? Fire doesn't kill him in one shot anymore. Fire used to kill the z zombies. I almost called them zombies again. Fire used to kill these guys in like one shot after they were done burning. What are you looking at, punk? Get out my face, bro. Look at him. Oh, no, no. Yeah, that's what you get. Oh, man. He, he died like a punk. <laughs> what a douche. Alright, let's see what else we got here. Okay, anybody else? No? Nope, I don't see anything else. Alright, good. Killed him. We killed them all! That's all of the cannibals on the entire island. We're so badass. <laughs> I don't believe that for a second. Alright, let's see what else we got over here. Alrighty. Uh, I don't think we can pick that up. Alright, let's come through here. Uh-huh, okay. This looks familiar. Oh, boy. We got some dumbasses down there. We got some fools need killing. There you go, boys. Suck it! Oh crap, I thought I saw some babies down there too. Some little mutant babies. Little mutant babies need killing. Can you light the babies on fire? Oh, I guess you can. <laughs> you know what? I got a better idea. Here, 
Here, babies, play with this. <laughs> yeah, eat it. Uh, what? Maybe water put it out or something? I don't see. Oh no, there's water down there. No, oh, yeah, there is water down there. Ah, oh, I wasted my um, I wasted my things. Well, whatever, I can get more. All right. So where are the cannibals? I don't see any cannibals. I mean, I could just j jump down there and have at it, but we've come this far without dying. Let's try not to die. Any Let's try not to die at all. Did I kill the cannibals? I don't even hear them anymore. Oh, there they are. Burn, baby, burn! Burn, 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 burn baby, burn! That's what you get. Oh, I missed the baby. Oh, I keep missing the babies. I suck. All right, you. Now you burn to death. Did I get him? Wait, where is he? I thought I saw him there. You little sneaky ninjas down here, man. There we go. Did I get that one? Yes, I got that one. All right. Where is he? He's over here, right? I saw him, like, in the side. I think he just keeps following me, which side I go to. So I saw his arms flailing around over here. Yep, there he is. There we go. Got him. Got him, boy. All right, let's go down there and let's go down there and, you know, dispense some justice. How about that? Got some of our blueberries. Get our stamina. He's done. Is there some water I can jump down in? Or All right. I want to be able to see, so I'm gonna take this out and let's deal with some little mutant babies. Now, don't take these babies lightly, man. They will mess you up. I mean, I'm telling you, if they jump at you, they take almost your full health bar. Like, in one shot. It's it's insane. Alright, so you can see right here, we got the... Now, I can't make use of this. Seriously. That looks like something I'd be able to make use of. What do we have here? Oh! There's a chainsaw down here somewhere? I don't know, maybe. Oh, I got the climbing axe, people. Got the climbing axe. Go over there. Lay down there and think about what you've done. Okay. I was going to explore more, but you know what? I think we're going to get back and save because we did exactly what we wanted to do today. Um, why don't we go ahead and use this climbing axe a bit? Also, one of my friends told me if you use the turtle shell, you can jump into the, um, to the very bottom of the sinkhole from the top. Is that true or is my friend trolling me and wants to see me die? You guys let me know in the comments. Is that true? Can I just, with a turtle shell, jump to the very bottom of the sinkhole from the very top? Did you E again? Yeah. There we go. And that's how you use the climbing axe. This thing's badass, by the way. I love this thing. That is awesome. That is a really good find. Oh, my goodness. I didn't expect that. How many are over there? That's what I'm worried about. I can handle one. Come on. There you go. Tire yourself out. Yep, you're done, pal. You're done messed up. You hear that? That's not just him. Hmm. It sounds like a armsy or a, or a Virginia somewhere. Maybe a cow man. Who knows? I don't know. Maybe that guy got stuck somewhere and I left him alive and just didn't realize it. Man, look at this guy. <laughs> look at oh, it's not funny. I know. Oh, look at this. Look at that poor sucker. So I wonder what happened up there. I wonder if he just stayed up there and they couldn't reach him or something. They could jump pretty high. What the hell is he still doing up there? That's what I'm thinking, man. He just like died of uh, thirst or something. All right, let's get out of this crappy place. How's our fish down here, man? That's crazy. Yeah, the next thing we're going to have to do is get the rebreather, but we're not going to be doing that next episode. Next episode um, is going to be a um, a building episode. Probably do a couple building episodes in a row. Oh, God. I got to make a, um, a place to store the skulls. The best place to store the skulls is actually um, uh, the, uh, not the slingshot, but the, the catapult. The catapult's a really good place to store skulls. Honestly, that's all it's good for. Do I have, a, do I have the axe out or not? Yeah, come on. On the freaking wall, bro. 
E. There we go. Yeah, once you get on the wall, you just press up, and that's how you climb up it. Yeah, this thing's this thing's cool. I really like it. It's gonna help me get around, that's for sure. All right, so now we need to go this way. This is where we jump down, by the way. And then we go up. I don't know what there's ropes here for. I guess they're just to assist you. I mean, in, in the game terms, they're probably put there just to let you know that that's a climbing a climbable wall. But you can kind of tell. It's like got a rough like look to it. You know, I don't think you really need the rope there to be honest. Alright guys, got home no problem. Middle of the night, but didn't really have a problem. Uh, slept through the rest of the night, and uh, I'm quite hungry. Uh, I just put these up though. There's no way they're going to be ready. So let me go ahead and have a couple of a uh, couple of bars. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to do some hunting. I really am. I really want to do it off camera though. I was I was debating hunting like at the end of this video because honestly, getting the map and the compass and the climbing axe took way less time than I thought. Right. It's weird that these are still here. I'm not really sure how, the, how those work, to be honest. Anyway, that stuff took a lot less time than I thought. So I was like, eh, let me go hunting. But the problem is, a lot of the hunting is me just looking for the deer and stuff. And it's just, eh. It's just kind of annoying. I think I'd rather just do it off camera. It's annoying to, like, like not record for, like, you know, five minutes. And then find a deer. And then record for, like, two seconds while I kill it. And then pause it again. You know, it's, eh, it's just kind of meh, you know. So I think I'll, I will hunt off camera. It's kind of weird that I opened it up and didn't have anything in it. Um, but I haven't left the game, so that might be that might be the reason. Okay, so I do know what I want to do today, though. And what we're going to do... Uh, well, not today, but for the end of this video. What I'm going to do is I'm going to come on up here. And um, let's put this in here. And then I'm going to think about what I'm going to do in here. Okay, so I think what we need to do next is finish the ceiling. Cut the hole in the ceiling. Do the stairs. I mean, it's that simple. I Yeah, I mean, there's nothing else to say. That's what we're going to do first thing tomorrow. But, I do want to use these logs for something else for now. So let's go ahead and bring these logs over here. Nope, put it back. There we go. Get back on the log sled, bro. Get on the log sled. Put your back into it. Let's do this. So I want to finish this bridge right here. I, this bridge has been up here for, you know, forever. As a matter of fact, at one point, I don't think I recorded it, but at one point when I was fighting cannibals from that bridge, um, or actually when I was fighting cannibals from the treehouse, I walked out onto the invisible bridge, you know, the, the imaginary bridge that isn't there, and yeah, I did fall and take some serious damage, so that was no good. <laughs> did not like that. Actually, how many more do I need for that? Um, Ten. Is that worth dynamite? I think that's worth a dynamite. Let's see where we want a dynamite. Uh, I don't know. This looks like a pretty good spot. It's a little risky though, man, because the trees are all going to fall this way. But you know what? I'll save, and then we'll dynamite. How about that? Nothing's risky when you can save. So, that's awesome. So, I'm going to go ahead and save the game, and then we're going to dynamite those trees. Hopefully, we'll get all th all four, and then we can just throw them all in log sleds. It'll give us a, a nice jump on uh, next video, because next video, we're going to need a lot of logs. Quite a bit of logs. Um, I don't know how many, but a lot. Way more than we have. So... This will, uh, we'll have some logs left over after we finish this bridge, assuming I do this correctly. Alright, so how did I want to do this? Um, right here? Eh, it sounds good. Let's do it. You guys said it doesn't matter which side you put the, uh, the explosives on. They fall in the direction you're facing. But how can I put it on the other side if I'm over here? Are you saying if I put it right there and then run over here, the trees will fall that way? I don't know, maybe that is what you're saying. Let's give it a shot. Why not? We just saved. So, see, and then come over here, and you're saying it should face, it should fall that way. Nope, I should, probably should back up, but that's okay. Oh, you're right, it actually did. I am, in, I am kind of in shock about that. I'm kind of in shock. I didn't think that would work for a second. I was all ready to say, ha ha ha, I told you so. I'm always right. No, okay, you know, Cage is not always right. Did this thing take any damage at all? It looks like it might have hit it, but I don't know. I guess it didn't. That is awesome. Well, there you go. You can put the dynamite on the other side. It doesn't matter. Um, and plus, if you, the thing is, you want to put it on the sides with more trees. Because then you'll get more trees in the um, in the explosion. That's the idea. So, And that's a good idea. And it's, it, it worked. So, thank you very much, guys. That's awesome. That is really awesome. I probably didn't do it perfect. But, you know, still. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Oh, my God. Oh, timer. Shut up. Okay. Well, you know what? Actually, that's pretty much perfect time for that timer. Uh, yeah, next episode, we're going to finish the uh, roof. We're going to put the stairs in. And if, if that, you know, goes quickly enough, then what we'll do is we'll start putting in storage uh, containers. Because I want to know where the stairs are before I put storage in. Because I don't want to put storage in the way of the stairs. So stairs first, then storage. Okay? And that's going to be next video, guys. Hey, if you guys don't have the map 
or the climbing axe, hey, now you know how to get it. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.